No, we can do this all year because we've got the heaters and um, blankets. We've actually sold them on Christmas Day as well. So they're all being used throughout the whole year. When all the covers are down, um, all the warmth stays in. VIP for outside, so it's a great way for them to enjoy themselves um, and make lots of noise and uh, not disturb other people, really. So it's a great tool for us to increase our um, floor space. I love the Crown Pavilion. This is um, the second installation we've taken on board. This is our Downton Hotel. The first one was our Hastings Hotel four years ago. And looking at this one, you can just see how well the old one is weathered. And they're both looking fantastic. And uh, I remember when we got the last one installed, how just how easy it was. The staff made it easy, they were amicable, they were efficient, they turned up on time, done the job, and it was great. So I thought, great company to deal with, Crown Pavilions, I'll do it again. I'll tell you what it gives us, it gives us the wow factor. The customers absolutely love it. They, they really sort of, they all want to know where they get them from. They, they ask me how much they are first of all, but no, they absolutely love it. It gives a real sort of atmosphere to the garden. And you're out in the hut and it frees up tables in, in the restaurant. So basically it's given us an extra sort of 20 to 30 covers every weekend, all year long. They're not just a, a, a summer addition, but they can be used uh, throughout the year. Uh, and we serve Christmas Day uh, lunch out here. Um, they're obviously heated and, and lit and we, can, we have uh, electrical sockets in them as well so we can add extra heating when required and the sides can be rolled down and it creates a really cosy, comfy atmosphere. Choosing Crown was obvious uh, due to when we saw it initially, the quality was superb and it reflects in our hotel. The wedding market's changed in uh, the UK. Uh, bride and grooms now want to go outside, and it's not just for weddings. Uh, as soon as people see it for private parties, um, you name it, as soon as they see it, they want it. We've got quite a big garden here at the Little Crown Jug, so it's basically utilising our garden space all year round. Whenever we take on a new site now, we tend to look at the garden and the size, and it's a top priority of ours to see if we can fit the huts in, how many huts we can fit in, because uh, we realise they you know, attract our, our customers and bring in more business. I think people will certainly turn their head to look to see what it is, and then um, if they then see the outside and it looks appealing, they'll want to come in and investigate the inside. So I think as a focal point, it's a very good one. The return on investments has been excellent, because as soon as we built it, People enjoyed it because it was a unique feature for the restaurant. I would say we got return on investments within the first three to four months. And ever since it's been a hit, now we are looking at filling the rest of the space. What would you prefer? An Argos table and chair or a crown pavilion? It's not nuclear science. It's not nuclear science.